This is my um, first uh, podcast up in um, South Tawanda in a long, 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 long time. Uh, I just got in tonight, a long ride, and my first attempt to get up here was a total disaster, which will affect me the rest of my life, but that's neither here or there. Uh, there's new um, input that uh, it was the um, various people in the White House who finally took the bull by the head and, and did the attack or raid on uh, Osama. Apparently o Obama was um, not the great hero that he claims to be, that he dragged his feet and that he um, was totally indecisive and even Hillary uh, showed that she had some sort of balls uh, in regards to this um, this situation. Um, so it'd be very interesting how this comes out. Talk about illusion. Um, talk about spin. How Obama all of a sudden he's like <laughs> he's still claiming he's Mr. Rambo, Mr. Caring, and all that, and worry. What was he worried about? I mean, the media loves the guy. He can't do wrong. He can walk on water, according to the media. And, um, and you know, it's like I said before, you know, we've lost thousands of people in Afghanistan, you know, getting their arms and legs blown off. Uh, you know, virtually every day we're losing them. And so he's worried about a few SEALs going in uh, into Pakistan and, and extracting it. Now the big deal is they want the, the wives of Osama. Why didn't they grab them? If this thing was so finally executed, why didn't they grab the... The woman then, and and, and, uh, and why'd they leave him there? The only thing I can figure out is they want him back because maybe o Osama wasn't there. Maybe they weren't his wives. Maybe, like I said, maybe we, maybe they got the wrong guy and they threw him in the ocean, and that's the reason. But uh, apparently they knew about where Osama was for months, and there was just total inact in inaction on this thing, and in inaction. And uh, finally, they, you know, they more or less decided to go ahead with it, whether or not Obama wanted it or not at that point. And now he's, uh, maybe that's kind of extreme. They, they basically, it was the dog, uh, the tail wagging the dog. Uh, these advisors said, hey, let's move, let's move. We didn't want to move. And they kept on pressuring him. But maybe he gave a nod or something. So I want to be as accurate as I can on what Obama did, but it surely wasn't a leadership position which all his, his followers would like us all to believe. Anyhow, i got to get some sleep. I'm tired. Um, we'll catch you later. And um, it's interesting how this thing is unfolding.